Hey, what is going on guys and welcome to another crazy video. If you like to fish in Stardew Valley and you're curious about where the best fishing spots are depending on the season, then stick around because we're about to reel in some answers. Okay, so I took a look at the lake, ocean, and the river to see if any of these fishing spots would have more potential for earning money depending on the season. And how I did this here is, I took the base value of every fish you can catch in each location for a particular season, and taking into account for the weather, I added the values up to equal a final score. Obviously, there's a level of variability of what you would actually catch, but the point of this is to test out if the lake is better than the river in, let's say, summer, not to be like, oh, this spot is better because the water's deeper and I'll get more gold quality fish. I'm strictly looking at the potential value between the three bodies of water in a season. First off, in the spring, the best fishing spot on a sunny day is going to be the mountain lake. With a value of 255, it was the highest score, and your chances of getting a largemouth bass is pretty good since there's only four types of fish here in the spring. A largemouth bass will sell for 100 gold base price, so it's worth a good amount of money and it's not uncommon either. And then on a rainy day, your best bet is to fish in the river. One thing to note here is depending on if you're in town or the forest, you'll get either a smallmouth bass or a chub. Both are worth 50 gold and the rest of the fish here can be found at either location, so it doesn't really matter in practice. But I just wanted to point it out so you would know how I added the score up. And the main reason the river scored higher for a rainy day is because of the chance to catch a catfish, which is worth a whopping 200 gold. So you'll have that chance to make some good money. Okay, and in the summertime, it's much simpler here. No matter what the weather is, you're going to want to be fishing in the ocean. It scored really high because there's a lot more variety of fish to be caught here, but most of them are worth a decent amount of money. So if you're thinking on the probability side of things, it's still a good spot to be, especially on a sunny day with a chance to catch that puffer fish and octopus. Oh, and the reason there's two values here is because, while technically there's a chance you could catch a super cucumber, it's pretty rare, so the second value is probably more accurate. And moving on to fall, the best fishing spot for this season is going to be the river. Rain or shine, it doesn't matter. With a score of 735, you have a chance to catch that catfish again, as well as a walleye when it's raining. Otherwise, on a sunny day, the tiger trout is still a good catch, and you'll definitely have a chance to make a lot more money, though, on a rainier day. And lastly, we have winter. This is where it gets a little complicated, depending on whether or not you're using a rain totem, because normally it never rains during the winter. Uh, but if you're keeping it simple, for a sunny day, the ocean is going to be your best bet. If you use a rain totem, however, you'll want to fish in the mountain lake because you can have a chance to catch a walleye there. It's a little bit of an increase in the score there. And it gets even more complicated if you've received the quest to catch a lingcod yet. If you have, you can fish for some in the mountain lake on a sunny day, and that would probably be the spot for you to go. But alright guys, that's all for this video. Let me know down in the comments where your favorite fishing spot is, and don't forget to subscribe for more Stardew Valley videos. Thanks so much for watching, and as always, stay crazy.